Man, 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 yo, baby, what is going on, my God? Look at you, you out here fucking looking like a monkey hanging off the tree for these damn crackers, bro, in this interrogation room. You supposed to be a real stepper, real killer, bro. You know damn well we don't give no information in no interrogation room, bro. You don't know. You don't know. That's what you That's what you should have been talking about. Only thing you should have been saying is you don't know it here. Why you got a whole hour video of you talking, talking to these people, bro? That is crazy. It's mind boggling to me because it's like we say, oh, niggas get snitch. They gonna they gonna get stitches or the snitches get get put in ditches and all this shit. You know what happens to a snitch? But it look like you doing a lot of cooperate cooperating in this damn uh video, baby. Yeah, I, I, I don't know what to think about this. You out here looking like a real tattletale, my guy. I don't know. So, I don't know. We're going to get into it. We're going we gonna to break down some key parts. But it, it's a lot of key parts in here because baby running his mouth, he talking. So, and that's what they need you to do in these interrogation rooms is talk. So, let's see what he's talking about. Car tried to hit Prince. You can see Prince up in the air down there on the hood of the car. They speeding up this way right here towards me. And I'm trying to get back. They in the car with you. See them in the car with guns. That's when I boom, 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 right here. You shot at them? Yeah, yeah, they about to shoot me. Okay. After they already shot somebody and they stole the car. You have a permit for that gun that you shot? I don't have no permit. I'm not a convicted felon. Oh, I got you. You, you need a permit to carry a gun. You know what? To carry and conceal. Yeah. Not to open carry. I wouldn't carry and conceal. You cannot open carry. You can return fire at somebody. You return fire? No, I'm just letting you know how the law works. Where, where yeah, it sound like you. It no, sound like you're trying to incriminate. Oh man! Actually, oh, no, no. do you know you committed a crime? Did not commit no, a crime. Listen, I'm asking you a question. I'm not sure, but I don't have a. I don't have a permit. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? I got the, the right to defend my life, nigga. That gun's registered under your name. No. The, the, when I fired, the car was speeding towards me after just having somebody up on top of me, and after just shooting somebody who I think on the ground. They see on the ground. He moved. Prince up in the air. He's. They. They tried to hit him. He just jumped up on top of the motherfucker. Everybody had to see him shoot. Him. The whole fucking restaurant. They shot him in front of people. People eating steaks. This boom. She was right there with me. She came and got. What kind of gun you have? What is? It? A forty. A Glock forty. forty Glock twenty three. Glock twenty three. Glock twenty three. You like going to a uh, shooting range? Do I like shoot? going to. Do I know uh, how to shoot? You have training on it, right? You, you, yeah, you, yeah, I know how to shoot. That's what I'm saying. You yeah, know? for sure. Oh, there's some shit going on. Boom, boom, boom into the crowd. I don't do shit like gotcha. that. Hell no. Up the gun tissue until I had no choice. You use both both, both hands. Both hands. Oh. Saying this ain't no fucking action movie. Who fired shots out of this car? I did. Action I'm an shooter. artist, not an artist. Like, I can't draw. They're giving me the rubber treatment. The rubber treatment? Mm, mm, mm. Oh, wait. Yeah, that video looks crazy. I know it's a bunch of broken down. I seen the whole interrogation, so I know it's broken down. And those are like snippets thrown together. Some is not in the right place, but just looking at that shit looks crazy. It sounds crazy, bruh. Because you wouldn't even expect this from from the baby, the known step of baby. Not the known step of baby, bruh. You wouldn't expect that. But but my my whole thing on this is, and I said this before about when the baby uh called called the police because he had shot the dude and um he was giving too much information on the phone and I made mean, to the dispatcher I, I mentioned that before like the baby has a, a tendency to give too much information like he talks way too much bruh some things ain't ain't as is don't need to be said like you had nothing to do with nothing then what is you sitting there trying to explain yourself and explain what happened and all that stuff? You got a lawyer for that. That's what your lawyer is there for. You talking about you got a very good lawyer and all this stuff. If you if you had anything to do with anything and you just said lawyer, you should have said lawyer. That's what he's there for. Not for you to sit in the interrogation room and talk. But let's listen to somebody you got to say. The valet's right in front, right? Yeah. The Chrysler pulls up right in front yeah. of the valet, and then another car? Nah, so you got You can leave it right there in front of you. You don't even got it already. You want to run on this? Yeah, well, you can see it. So this, whatever street that is, 
Baby, 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 bro. What are you delusional, bro? So I don't think you understand the grasp the concept. That's why what Ayo say, like these dudes ain't real street niggas. I really believe that, bro, because they can't really be real street. There's no way you can get into an altercation with a shooter and you be like, yeah, just call the manager. He clear everything up for me. You're not. No, my guy, you're not. You're not him. You're not him that'd be able to call them shots. Sorry. Sorry. You're not him. This is why you're in the interrogation room. Because they, they want you to, to self-incriminate yourself or probably put yourself in a position to where as though they can get a charge on you. Possibly get a charge. And hearing you talk and just ramble on, you're gonna self-incriminate yourself. It's gonna it's gonna happen. You're gonna incriminate yourself. Just Keep going on and on and on. You, the the smartest thing I heard you say in this whole interview was, if it, if I if I felt like I was in in the defensive state, I'd just say lawyer. You should have said lawyer a long time ago, my guy. Tell us about your trip, lawyer. What's the big deal, lawyer? You were down in Sonora, weren't you? You don't think Agent Jessup and the DA know about you and Poppy Lawyer, Griffin? Lawyer, lawyer. You know you were at his ranch. I know I need a lawyer. A long time ago, when they booked you, you should have said lawyer. Everybody want to think they know the laws and, and think they can, you know, finagle. it's loopholes and everything. These guys play for loopholes. They use words and phrases and stuff that you say. This is why... The, the Miranda starts with, you got the right to remain silent. You have the right to remain silent. There's a reason why it starts with that. A reason. It's crazy. Easy, yeah. yeah you, you know? We uh, just have to ask these questions. I if if you weren't anyone else, we would ask you the same questions. So Where'd answer. you get the gun? The, the, I'm just giving y'all, I'm just giving y'all, I guess you know what I'm saying? Did mm -hmm. you see Mr. Williams on the ground or you just got Nah, it's that far. I told you it was that far I away. I, and niggas still down there shooting. So I never once went towards. Towards the fire. Never once. The, the, when I fired, the car was speeding towards me after just having somebody up on top of me. And after just shooting somebody who I think on the ground, they see on the ground, he ain't moved. So as far as we know, he ain't even breathing at the time. You get what I'm saying? I know His you, car speeding towards me. I know you said that you're defending yourself. 
Did you think uh, the car's gonna hit you? You're shooting here? You know, I didn't think no car was gonna hit me. That I wasn't just shooting at no car that I feel like, you know what I'm saying? They just stole the car. I already know he's on the ground, not moving. You get what I'm saying? And I see the car got pressed up in the air. He's they they tried to hit him. He just jumped up on top of the motherfucker. You know what I mean? They get him. Okay. He really got hit with the motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? They did. He's up. Up, right? yeah, he Prince. Yeah. Up on top. Yeah. They hit him That's with the car. Yeah. Right. Gotcha. Yeah. They hit him with the car. Okay. I just want. To now I want y'all to pay real close attention to the baby. Like he's really pleading his case as if they're the judge and the jury. As if he's on the stand, you know, he got sworn in. Like, bro, do you not understand that they are not going to determine whether or not you go to jail or not? They're there to build a case to see if they can have a case to push through. They ain't doing nothing for you. You sitting there trying to plead your case whether it's self-defense. Boys, stop. Let's get back into it. Clarify. It's coming. So yeah, it, it, at this point, if I wasn't, if I probably wasn't right here, because I'm really ducking behind the truck. You see on camera, like I'm like this behind the truck, because I see him hitting B and I see him coming this way. So as far as I'm concerned, they get ready to come right. So you by the, the police, you, sir. You by the corner. So if you ain't do nothing, why do you keep explaining yourself? Why do you keep having to explain yourself? You don't have to keep explaining yourself if you ain't doing. If you ain't do nothing. If you had nothing to do with the incident and everything is everything, you was defending yourself, you was returning fire, blah, 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 why you keep trying to defend yourself? You don't need to keep fucking trying to defend yourself if you ain't do nothing. If they ain't believe the first statement that you gave, that's what the lawyer for. Because they're going to keep asking you questions on top of questions in different phrases to get you to keep saying the same thing over and over it gets you to say something that you didn't say the first time or say the last time if you're looking at them like yeah just keep talking go ahead hey just keep talking yeah we need all this we need we need everything hey we're building the case on your dumb ass the police are damn near coming from this way right after the car got out of the clear like the, the, the second day boom and i boom boom in the intersection the police are, are right here coming up the street you know what I'm saying? They saw that car speed past them. They saw it. They saw that car flee the scene, which is why I don't know why motherfuckers are treating us like, you know what I mean? Like, we ain't leaving like that. If they, the police could have pulled right up to us, we had, the I'm the first call the shots fired. Uh, the officers heard the shots. You know what I'm saying? No, they I know. What's going on. They were there. So obviously, if they don't know what's going on, I, I just want you to understand our side. It's not that we want to blame you for being there for no reason. Yeah. Let's say uh, you were the shooter, of, like the one that started. We don't know that, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, but this is what I'm saying. Victim or whatever you are. That's what I'm saying. The same so way. Whoever has a gun, we don't know if they're gonna shoot at us. That's so what I treated that way. Yeah, then, then we can talk. You know what I'm glad you said that. that now, but look, I'm glad you said that. Whoever got a gun out there, I don't know if they're gonna shoot at me. No. So the same way y'all telling me to have clear, spot on judgment of all these other details, y'all was right there too. But when it shots fired, what what's the procedure when it shots fired? Make sure you okay for it. Bottom line, it's the same shit. So if it, that's what I'm saying. Like it ain't so, no, they, I know just as much as the motherfucking police know. Okay. I know just as much as they know. I know shots fired. Yeah. I know who's on the ground not moving. And I know he's with it. the mother of his kids. For all I know, she in the damn, they took the car with her in. Now when Kidnapped. you see the car going through. It ain't going to hit speed. You, shoot you, see, you see that car. I'm thinking they're going to turn think? right. They turn, they, what makes me think about that? He's a threat to you. You know what I'm saying? Is he coming they, at you? They you just shot him point blank range right, gotcha. right in front of him. It's close. And you see the white male driver. You see a uh, Hispanic yeah. person on the passenger seat. The car, there's multiple people in the car. What, and they, they just do? hit. What do they do that make you They think? just hit Pete right here before okay. they got to me. That's why you and shot the, yeah, 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 and then they're coming towards me. I'm right here in so the front of the car. Your boy. Uh, yeah, I see him Pete. from. I see them hitting him from behind the car this way. Remember, I'm on the corner. Yeah, I got so you. when I see him hitting him and speeding up this way, and they the shooters he gets hit by the car. Yeah, yeah, and they the shooters. I'm look. I'm in the open right here. Yeah, and while I'm in the open, I come and 
get behind the car this way. So when they come, I'm not just out and over the point because I don't know who that is. Let me ask you a question. At the point that your assistant had given you in the back with a gun, my assistant back there scared straight. I had to yeah, but you told take him, it. Give me the, give me the yeah, I said, back. Give my bag, give my bag, give my bag, give my bag. Fine. I snatched my bag from her. No, it wasn't in the car. She had it. When we pull up and we get out of that place, she comes to my car. Okay, Mr. Kirk, dude, I had a manager right here ready. She comes and grabs whatever. She only got to let me hold phones. Carries your stuff. Yeah. So she gives it to you. She only got phones. Would have left the bitch in the car. You know what I'm saying? Would have left the gun in the car. I don't need Did anyone else that was with you start shooting at the car as well? I don't know. No, I really don't. Real talk. I don't know. Oh, wait. Mm, mm, mm. Hey, right there. I mean, for, for, from listening to Grunt and and watching Grunt videos, that right there, I will refer to Baby as a lie. He answered the question too fast for even the even the person to even get the question all the way out. So, mm, mm, mm. and th this is what I'm talking about by by talking too much, talk too much. You know what I'm saying? Because they're asking about the gun, right? Baby, he too busy talking about, yeah, I mean, you know, my, my, my sister, she's scared straight. She don't even know what to do. She ain't never been in no situation like that. I've been I've been a real step. I'm like, give me the bag. Give me the bag. You know, the bag got the heat in there. He, bruh, you talking too much. Too much. So we going to double back to what Baby said. Baby said, the bag had it, the gun was in his backpack. It wasn't in the car. The guy asked him, was it was uh, the gun concealed? He said, nah. He said, he said, he he has the right to open carry. Do you say you can't you can't open carry uh, a firearm? He said, I got the right to return fire though if my life is in danger. But this not that's not the the question at hand. The the gun is on your person. A unregistered gun to you is on your person. You used it. A unregistered firearm in your person on you. You used that. That's what he's referring to. That's why you gotta listen and not talk so much. Just listen to what he's trying to say because he's trying to set you up. The firearm does not belong to you. It doesn't belong to your assistant. The bag is yours. You use the firearm that doesn't belong to you, that's not registered to you. It doesn't matter. You are responsible for that firearm. It doesn't matter. I don't do dirty guns. I don't do dirty guns. Well, guess what, baby? You're holding a dirty gun because that gun is not registered to you which makes that a dirty gun. You don't even know who it's registered to. So you're walking around with an unregistered gun. This is why I keep saying, bro, you should have said lawyer a long time ago. But they let you keep going. They want, no, no, no. You see in the wave off the question. No, no, let them talk. Let them talk. I need to write this shit down. He already gave me some important information. But all in all, yeah, you got to do better. Got to do better for real. Yeah, man. That's what you got lawyers for, baby. You should have you should have called your lawyer in a long time ago. Yeah, man. This is the difference between, you know, real killers and people who who want to be killers. Want to act as if they will step on some real shit and kill some real shit. When they get inside this interrogation room, you hear what he's saying. He's he's trying to play victim role right now. He he hit Prince. He really hit Prince. Oh, you see me. I was ducked behind the car. Man, like, share, subscribe, comment. I'm Acog Chop. I'm out. Like at that point, it's got that. You hearing more gunfire? At that, that point. Was yours? Nah, that, that I can't call. That I can't call. Boy, you wish you some doubt I was saying he counting mine. Trade nigga don't play nigga. Got little bro with a sway bigger. Small nigga named Ray nigga. Got big guns. He a straight hitter. Hell a nigga that's down the ride. Three, seven,